<laughs> All right, last looks. Pick yes, yourself. Yes, Here yes, we go. You always had said that Logan was going to be his last Wolverine movie, that this has to be the best one, and it has to hit a bar that perhaps some of the other movies hadn't hit before. And cut. We got it. Cut. Hallelujah. There's always something strange about the last day because it's suddenly over. It was kind of painful, kind of bittersweet, but Hugh, he's such a pro and he's so generous. At least for me, it's wanting to make sure it's good for him. Hugh Jackman, yes. that is the cessation of main unit main photography unit. for you on... And what a way to go. And what a way to go yeah. in a stall. The reality is that when an actor is really great in a role and finds a way to connect to audiences and everyone else, what it has to be, it seems to me, is that they've found a way to connect a deep part of themselves to this character. There's no way that they can just be kind of faking it. Let me say one thing. I've had the pleasure now of making three major motion pictures with this person. And um, beyond him being enormously and conceivably talented, um, he is also just one of the greatest persons in the world, the greatest collaborators and greatest friends. I mean, I know I wouldn't find anyone among this sea of people who would disagree, and I think that at least is something I aspire to be as I go forward in my life, as someone as collaborative and kind and ready for action every day and greatness as you are every day, so thank you. And what a great role you've given everyone um, for so many years, and I hope this lives up to it. I'm hope to God, because we work You kind of take your cue from him and how he's choosing to navigate it and follow that lead out of respect and appreciation for all that he's done. The film is full of unexpected events and attitudes and manners and relationships. You think you know exactly where you are and what you're witnessing, and then someone does something and you realize that you were wrong. It was something else. And I think that's what makes it exciting. I think what we owe a character who has reached as many people as Hughes Wolverine has is to end on a note of heart. I felt like we owed him not making a bigger one or a louder one or more spectacular one, but making the most feeling one, the one that stirred you up inside the most that moved you. Before I go to the cake, uh, it's a really surreal day. I've got my 16-year-old in the trailer who was not even born when I started playing this. <laughs> uh, and uh, Jim and about five people, we've been probably working on this for three or four years. It is, no movie has meant more to me than this movie. I'm really, really proud of what we've done. We could not have done it without every single one of you. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much for helping us realize this dream. Let there be cake. This film felt different to all of them. Every day, every scene for me was a kind of battle to get the best out of that character, to get the best out of me and, and the situation. We've seen a lot from him, you know, from his love story with Gene to his conflicts with some of the other X-Men to the degree to which he served as a sort of guide and a facilitator in Days of Future Past. We've seen a lot of different facets of that character's life. It kind of only end in one place. I love this character. This character has been amazing to me. Thank you so much. Awesome. I'd be lying if I said that I would have been okay if I didn't feel everything was left on the table. And I mean everything. I don't even know what to say. It hasn't sunk in yet. <laughs> okay.